I love driving down the Great Ocean Road because when it gets a bit busy in Melbourne, you know, it's not too far away. It, it has the beach, the scenic route. It, it has the forest that you can go and visit, the cool spots to go hang out, the culture that you can embrace. Everything about it's amazing. The Great Ocean Road is 151 miles long and it stretches over the southeastern coast of Australia. It is the ideal way to travel through Victoria If you like surf culture, come to Torquay. It's the home of iconic brands like Rip Curl or Quicksilver and is Victoria's capital for surfing. We're off to Teddy's Lookout to see where the sea meets the Great Ocean Road. Hey, we're at another awesome spot just off the Great Ocean Road. It's like 10 minutes away from Lawn. It's called Erskine Falls. And as you can see, this waterfall is over 30 meters high. Yeah, it's definitely over there. I can see it. That was amazing. I think I'm never going to forget this, seeing something so rare as that. Wildlife Wonders is a really beautiful piece of land. It's on Gadabanu country and it presents a, a whole variety of really gorgeous ecosystems. So the funds raised through visitors, 100% of it goes back to conservation projects right across the Otways. Hey, we're here at the Twelve Apostles. These limestone cliffs have been eroded by the ocean and the wind for over 10 to 20 million years, and I just love coming here. Just 10 minutes away from the Twelve Apostles is an amazing place called Forage in the Foreshore in Port Campbell. personal to me this this experience because my my son's mix is Torres Strait Islander and he's Guna Jamara as well so it's really important for me um, as his father to come down and really learn about his culture. <laughs> <laughs> 